The funeral service for a fallen Terre Haute police officer is going on right now. Let's head live to Terre Haute for Officer Brent Long's funeral. It's a short time ago. Brent was selected to be a canine officer, and he selected his canine partner, Shadow. Brent and Shadow made an, an immediate impact on the streets, and they were a tremendous crime-fighting team. Brent became interested in working drug interdiction on the interstate and had recently made a traffic stop that yielded a large seizure of cocaine and another that resulted in the arrest of a homicide suspect. Brent was also a field training officer responsible for the training of new officers where he provided an, an excellent example for them to follow. Brent was an outstanding police officer. He was, high, high, <coughs> he was highly respected by his fellow officers and supervisors alike. He was extremely dedicated to serving and protecting his community, and he truly loved his job. Brent was also an outstanding person, which is the reason he had so many friends, and I am proud that I was one of them. He was also a devoted family man. It was an honor and privilege to have worked with Brent. He'll be sadly missed, but never forgotten. That's live footage from the funeral of Officer Brent Long. Exactly one week ago, Long was shot and killed while helping serve a police warrant on Terre Haute's north side. Officer Long is the 13th police officer in Terre Haute that has died while serving the line of duty. The funeral started about an hour ago at Indiana State University's Holman Center. After the funeral, Long's body will be brought in procession through the city of Terre Haute. You can continue to watch the service and the procession live on our website, WLFI.com.